Danielle Vogt is carrying a six-month-old kitten named Digit. It was found on the side of a road in Hostetter, Westmoreland County. The kitten was shot twice with a pellet gun in the chest and back. You can see the blood in the fur where the entry wound is on the back. There's a pellet right here underneath the skin. You can actually feel it there. What you're about to see now may be very disturbing. Digits cannot walk. She can only drag herself because a pellet is lodged in her spine. One, it could be somebody's pet, and two, the suffering is just, in my mind, the worst part of it. It's not only bad enough that you shot the cat to begin with, but then you left it lay by the road to either get hit or to suffer and die. Here is the x-ray showing the pellet lodged in the kitten's spine. It's the white dot in the center of the x-ray. Vote is the owner of Vote Veterinary Services, a mobile veterinary clinic. She will spend the next six months to see if Digits regains the use of her hind legs. I can't really take out the bullet in her spine. That would be an orthopedic or neurosurgeon that would need to do that. She can minimally move her back feet, so she still has some function there, which is all good news. The other good news is she's about six months old, I would say, and kittens because they're still growing, have a wonderful capacity to heal. If Digits cannot regain the use of her legs, she will need a special owner and a wheelchair for pets. For adoption, call Paws across Pittsburgh. If that doesn't happen, Digits may be put down.